I had a guy write me and say, Sue, I'm looking for a cuck holding woman. Where would you find something like that? And for those of you who don't know, cuck holding is a fetish um, experience where the man likes to watch. It's a power differential where the man likes to watch his partner with other guys, sometimes called hot wives, but it can be, if, if they use the term cuckold with me, it means that they are a bit submissive and like that power differential. So it's kind of being like tied up in the corner and forced to watch your wife with somebody else and she's saying, well, he can't service me, but this guy can. And and it's part of that denial. And if you don't get it, you don't get it. But you know, you think that, that you know people play and they wanna be denied. They really don't want to climb us. They want to have that denial or tease. So, where do you find it? And, you know, and I, and, you know, certainly our duckling group is better than, you know, anything vanilla. Uh, don't try and pitch that in a vanilla group. You know, you can't really go to a swing group because they don't really let a lot of single guys in. But we are managed by women and we screen them really well. And I tell people you got to come to six events, you know, not that you have to, but before you sort of get a real sense of finding what you're looking for, but you can come and we can help facilitate that. If you know, we, if I know that there's a couple that play with single men, I can, you know, introduce them, that kind of thing. And, and they've got profiles and you can see if you're finding something specific. Because it's, sometimes when you get niched, it's, it's really niched and to find what you're looking for is hard. So yes, I like our group because we're in the middle and we're there, but there are lots of places near you, lots of swing clubs that may let you join. Now they're not going to be free, um, you know. And if you're going to be online, the problem is is that there are a zillion people that are not real. Like at least ducklings, I'm going to put my word on it, saying that I approve or my team approves everybody who joins. So they have to be real, and we check out profiles, and we like I'll pick up the phone and call somebody and say, "Hey, can you talk to me? Because oh, you want to join, and I need to know who you are." So it's about that. It's about, and it's also fun community. We just finished this crazy weekend. And just you know, stay with me. I'm going to, my next video is going to be showing you all the fun things that we did all weekend. But it's also about making sure that you can find something that works for you and to be able to tell you that you're not a mutant, crazy, you know, freaky, you may be freaky, but you know that it's okay to see as long as it's safe and consensual and legal, you know, so no octopus stuff or <laughs> weird ass shit that is out way outside of the norm. And it's not that I'm going to judge you. It's just going to say, my group doesn't share in that. So let, let me see if I can introduce you to someplace else, or you're going to have to find something very specific online. But to know that there are people out there who share what you're doing and not to be afraid of it. I've been a clinical SEX therapist for more than 25 years. Follow me and send me a note at sue at sexwithsue.com if you have any questions.